Hello everybody, welcome back to Strategic Command World of War Paradox Gamer playing. We are consolidating our position in Britain. And I just found out I made an, uh, an error here. Uh, I have all my subs on silent. And if you are on silent, you will not discover um, enemy tr uh, transports and stuff like that. So I, uh, I forgot to put them all on uh, hunt. So they should all be on hunt mode. Now that we uh, rule the seas, they should actually always be in hunt mode. Silent is if you really want them to hide and not get caught by a strong Royal Navy, which is not the case anymore. So let me just get that straightened out. Uh, 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 okay. That's all of the active uh, subs. So that means we could actually have transport in our midst. <laughs> so let's do some some scouting here. Not nothing there. Uh, let's take uh, yeah, let's take this one there. Just one space between, then you can actually. Oh, there we go. Bradley uh, headquarter right there. Okay, let's take a shot. Uh, okay, that could be more than. Um, mm, 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 mm. Okay, let's start by taking this one down here. And it should have enough to do some scouting. There is one there. What is that? The Eichelberger, that's another headquarter. Okay. Uh, we do have the whole navy here, so it should not be a problem. I just need to find out if there's more. Yeah, right there. This is the first USA. Attack and scout. This is the second USA. We could have a lot here. This is a bit scary. Let's um, <laughs> how do this? Come up from the side with this one. I think we can just use it to a destroyer for that. And then come up here. Use a destroyer. And then what else do we have? One there. First USA. Is there any more? Could still be one behind there. Okay, let's take the battleship. Can they reach here? Yes. Can we take the battleship up here? That'll destroy them completely. And then bring this submarine up. This looks to be the last one. Maybe. Yeah, I think we cleaned it out. Okay, that was actually pretty damn close. Okay, there could be uh, more on the way. Let's do some uh, scouting with this one. And continue with this one. Okay, all of this is clear. Ooh. <laughs> okay. So let's bring them back down here. We have a cruiser that comes out there. 
and a battleship comes out here. The rest here needs to reinforce. Fighters. Destroyer. Heavy cruiser. And the heavy cruiser in here. And also, a lot of submarines over here that needs to replenish. They cannot go all the way. That's a new rule in this game. You can only go five points for naval units at one time. We can bring this one down there. This one will go down there. Okay. Catastrophe <laughs> barely averted. We have this one as well. Okay. On the ground. Let's see. Do all the fighters need to replenish as well. So there will be no bombings. And how many points have I spent? I have almost spent it all. I remember the the armor here needs to replen needs to upgrade. And that's a hundred points. The armor here needs to upgrade. I'm down to 55. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Ooh, nine. That's an unupgraded tank unit from Canada. What about this one? Okay, let's try and take this one out. Then move the army up. Take one shot here. I did take two losses from that. We could destroy it with the army. And I'm not interested in that spot, or am I? I guess I am. A bit reluctant, of course, but I need to progress. Bristol itself is supply 2, so next 2 will just be supply 1. This is currently in supply 4 from the harbor. So I cannot, I can move it here, it will still be 3 though. Yeah. Four, three, two, one. No, the supply is simply too low. I need to get the headquarter back up here with a fully supplied Plymouth. And that's going to take a couple of turns. So I'm not going to move out from this position right now. I am going to transport these guys across, though, if I have the points. That's 30. Yes. Okay. I forgot to attach that one. Okay, that was a lot of points spent. Let's move these guys up here. I hope I don't have to spend a lot here in the eastern front. We did have this one. I can only give it two points. Might as well just wait. Do we have anything that really, really needs to get? Get. Uh, we have this one at eight, and we have the Bulgarians at eight. How much does that cost? It's gonna cost eighteen. And then we can get this one to nine. No, can't get it up. Okay, a little bit low there on points. I am not liking that at all. Do we take Lvov? I think we do. And do some damage to this bomber here. Oh, nice. Completely obliterated it. 
Let's see, supply three from Premisal. Yeah, we should probably just stay there. Now we have the tanks. If I can destroy one, that would be preferable. Let's do that. One gone. Actually, shift these guys out. We might have a chance of destroying one more. Ah, come on, I need some better shots than that. I have uh, a couple more that can try. That's not gonna work though. Oh, maybe if I can move it out. No, I can't. I would have to move the Hungarians away. And then move this one in. That's a bit of a long shot, but okay. I'll give it a I'll give it a shot. Yes. Perfect. Two medium armor destroyed. That's perfect. What about up here? No. Could destroy this mechanized. I think we should do it. Okay, it just bows out. Fair enough, fair enough. Down here, we can take out this one. So why not do it? Okay. We can take Heraklion now. Creed is mine, and I need uh, the port to come back up before I can transfer them back across. But the aircraft we can use on the Eastern Front. That takes us to Africa. Remember, we don't have any points, so we need to be somehow precise about this. Okay, let's do this. Let's take it out completely. that one let's move uh, the headquarter in there not really just move it up here can we replenish these guys yes go there what supply four three just go there okay Right, that's fine. Let's go down here. We have the South Africans. Which I can destroy completely. There we go. Let's head for Khartoum. Uh, it's a bit long way. We need to probably stay in Kasala to be able to get there. Oh Malakal, no that's one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Kasala is the place to be in. So we'll we should move back up north. Yeah. Shift them around a little bit. Okay, China. <clears throat> we do have some points for the uh, Italians. Well, let's just save that up. Over here. Let's see what we can do. I should probably move first and then attack. Attack. 
because otherwise these guys will not be able to get there. Okay, good, good. That means we can move in and take it. And all these should be unsupplied at this point. So am I, but uh, not for long. Another one bites the dust, and let's see, let's start moving these guys up if they are fully upgraded. I can actually take it to 12. this one back as well upgrade mm, mobility for this one aircraft moves to southern China can I go into Indochina I cannot go to Indochina okay but we can station them here in Haiku there's the submarine I need someone down here as well when uh, when Hong Kong joins the uh, uh, when I declare on the uh, Western Allies to take Hong Kong. Nothing major, just uh, a small unit. This one goes in there. No, it should actually stay the way it is. Where are the garrisons? They're down here. We need one up there, one over there. So this one goes there. We'll stay here. This one goes there, and then we need some over there. So that's which one is that? That's this one. Okay, garrison's in place. Okay, so let's move on over here. We want to take Sang Yi. go in there. I can. Okay, and then the other thong here on this side. Take Galmud. Order forward. This one as well. This one will move later. Okay, so we're taking both of these towns, uh, all three actually. We just need to mop up this, and then we'll meet up in Guangzhou from two sides. From there, we should be able to reach Urumqi. These are going into Burma, and we are starting to assemble the northern army as well. I like the looks of my navy as well. That looks really good. Still 489 points. Check the research for Japan. Production tech and industrial tech should be get started. And that's most of the points right there. Okay. Do, 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 do. 
let's see, one turn to take Guangzhou, maybe two. And another two to three turns to take Urumqi. Before the end of the year, we should have China out of the war. Okay, end of the turn. The Hotspur Destroyer deploys for service. 224 group forms in India. 25 fourth Indian forms in India. Survivors from Galmud reform their units in Urumqi. Partisan activity. Churchill accuses Gandhi of being in the service of Japan. And the Red Orchestra espionage group is broken up in Berlin. Germany develops advanced subs level 2 and spying and intelligence level 2. Okay. Now for the long AI turn. <clears throat> I should probably build another German headquarter as well. As I'm getting more units on the Eastern Front, I will be needing that extra headquarter. I still assign two headquarters for Britain. So I'm pretty sure we'll need it. Strategic bombers in Britain. I do have escorts now, upgraded escorts. Strategic bombers in Sudan. A couple of those. Soviet bombers are usually not that dangerous. One damage there though. Tactical bombers in Palestine. Medium bombers too. And the Allies have a lot of bombers. Counterattack on Lvov. Let's see if the Hungarians can hold the ground. Looks like it. Counterattack in Britain. This is a full army and it stops. Okay, so that means. Ah, this is good. They cannot dislodge my full strength armies, which of which I got two now in Britain. Nice. Looks like Portsmouth is gonna be my next target. I think I'll just ship these guys around. Cavalry can't really do anything. I still have the mechanized. Whew, that's good. <laughs> no more. Okay, I got the guys in Koenigs back. I can shift them around. Bulgarians get hit as well. The Soviets are really pushing. Gotta give them that. They're just not really getting anywhere.
desperate attempt on the surrounded Chinese to break out. Not gonna happen. Soviet attacks. Especially Lublin is getting hit hard. But we have the upgraded medium armor come into the rescue this turn. Bulgarians get another hit. They really need to get some reinforcements as well, which I should prioritize over any research in the coming turn. Heavy armor does not do any good. And the uh, Soviet summer offensive is starting to peter out a little bit as we go into September. The weather will get worse. And once the next spring comes around, I should be ready with uh, an offensive of my own. are pulling out of the Suez into Palestine. And the Soviets are still able to have a too a too thick uh, front line. Units in Lublin are very seasoned, got three stars. Could go back to two when I replenish them. Okay, Allied replenishments. Looks like I am safe in Britain. There's uh, not much he can do other than landing American units, of course, which I am supposed to prevent and which I will try and do better. Garrison spotted in Barbera. Garrison on Cyprus, doesn't matter. Okay. Now it's raining. <laughs> I do have my bombers and my fighters ready now, but uh, it's, uh, that rain is pretty relentless. Let's start out at sea. Okay, so there's probably nobody right here next to me. Let's start with the one here. Come straight down to here a bit further, come around and move up. Okay, let's do the same with this one, straight down here. Move around, move up. Right, nothing there. Okay, um, move down this way. Oh, right there, enemy contact. Uh, first Marine and third USA. Okay, we just take them out with the battleships. Should be pretty easy.
Oh, unless they evade the damage, obviously. Uh, so we'll just take the heavy cruiser here. All right, are there any others? Nope. Okay, further out. Start scouting this area. No? Okay. Come down this way, this way, this way. Okay, nothing there. Let's use this one for surface rating here. And we should remember to put these on hunt as well. And bring one up this way. And the others need to upgrade. How was the um, research? I thought I finished something. Yeah, advanced subs level 2. And advanced fighters level 2. I'm going to wait until the end of the turn to see if I will be doing any research at all. Let's actually upgrade the subs that are in the porch right now. Send out the heavy cruiser. And the carrier. Another heavy cruiser. And a destroyer. And a heavy cruiser. Okay, this is my entire navy that we have here. We still haven't moved this one. It's at 8 strength point. Let's move it back for upgrade and replenishment. Alright, so on the ground in Britain. What are we going to do here? Probably going to take this space here. I will probably move these guys up. And then I need the headquarter up here. That means we cannot move the army around because I will replenish these guys here. Okay. So one more space taken, and I could move uh, one of the cores over. It doesn't really matter at this point, we can wait with that in a little bit. And I again forgot to attach those armies, come on. <laughs> right, Eastern Front. So we do need to do some stuff here. This one needs to upgrade. This one needs to replenish. These two will uh, ship places and replenish and replenish. Where do we need to attack? I could bring them in here, um, attach to the headquarter. I could bring them down this way.
that will partly relieve the Italians from duty. We need to replenish here. And we can just replenish the rest around here. And we're down to 200 points. Um, over here, the Hungarians. It's time to give it a rest for a turn. Let me just see these guys. I cannot get them out before the port is back in action. Replenish. Also, the Bulgarians, Slovakians, and the Germans here. And that's my points. <laughs> so, I don't even have points for North Africa. Let's see if it's necessary. I think it is. Yeah, but we don't have them. Let's just advance over here. And we see the Indian core over there. We'll just go and match it. Bring these guys over there. Supply here is four. So that will be three, two, there we go. Just keep pushing south, and then from over here, we'll be pushing the other direction. there 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 okay still got 300 points for the Italians so what are we uh, what are we gonna do here get some research started we did get the naval going I don't want to spend any more points on production and industrial because they're so far behind that it doesn't really make much of a difference. Um, so I think we can start getting things upgraded. Or we can wait until we actually get the um, infantry weapons too, then we can upgrade with the mobility as well. get the bombers up here and the fighters so we can get the uh, Navy back to full strength on all accounts in itself is uh, costly and we can upgrade that once that becomes available to us okay Japan so we need to finish this do it. 
get this one back to max. Okay, so we're heading towards Guangzhou or something like that. I want to finish off this guy here. Couldn't do it. Just couldn't do it. Now we see an enemy unit over here. I need the headquarter in the town. I can't get there. See, this is supply three, which will become eight. So they will just stay there and then move the guys forward. Replenish. Replenish. Alright, we could probably take Guangzhou next turn. Here. Just move up to the border. This one's ready to deploy. This one, let's elite reinforce it. This one can upgrade. This one can replenish. And This one is on the way to Lang Chao, where it actually needs to be now. I need to move this one back, because otherwise we will have partisans appearing in the back. We can't have that. Just get this one down there. And this one will go all the way to Yinan. Okay, no more garrison movement. And we still have 383. How's the research in Japan? It's good. We're getting ground attack weapons next. We should start building something. We can still build two more submarines at 200, 200 points each, so we can get one. Two carriers, two submarines on the way. That's it for the turn. Don't think I forgot anything. Uh, should stop moving these guys back if they can get out of here. Okay. End the turn. Let's see. Oh, that's the uh, Cairo Garrison. The cost twenty five. Um, do we really need a garrison in Cairo? Well, it's pretty cheap, so I don't know. Yeah, that's, that's, that's okay. The Egyptian Legion is formed to Cairo to serve the Axis. Great partisans disrupt supply. Oh! I should have one up, up there. It's a Saloniki. <clears throat> Germany develops naval weaponry level 2. And Italy develops advanced fighters level 2. 
And they're finally done with the extra cost there. So now Italy will start getting some decent points again. Now the US Navy, when it comes, will probably be fully upgraded. So we should prioritize getting our Navy up to level two, if possible. British are stuck in Sudan. They could get out from Port Sudan still. So there's an escape route. Just don't think they're going to use it. October 9 now. Still okay weather. Strategic bombers in Britain, not a problem. Damage evaded. Strategic bombers in Sudan. And the usual bombings on the Eastern Front. Now we have the uh, Italian fighters to help out. I also got the Italian bombers, which I can use. Africa Corps really needs to replenish as well when I get some points. Should probably stop advancing and get them uh, back together before moving into Palestine. Oh, that was a nasty shot by the army. That was also a nasty shot. Okay. Which is pretty much why they did it. I'm gonna have to ship some uh, ship some units around. Yeah, they're still attacking the Soviets in uh, in the east. should see less and less of this as we start to push them back but that's gonna be in the spring and summer they'll still have the winter to do some th some stuff I just don't think they have the strength to do anything major which is pretty obvious oh well there are armies are still pretty good. They've got some mechanized and some medium armor to take advantage of this. Let's see if they do it. Still trying to take Lublin. Yeah, we'll try to get the two um, armor units together so they can start working uh, together. They can really do some damage. They will at least take out one unit per turn from now on out.
Oh, they decided to replenish instead. <clears throat> this means my units in the north should be safe. They are bringing some more mechanized up. Not at full strength. But they, they can still feel the lots a lot of units. And I'm still down on some research, if I remember correctly. Uh, submarine level th 3, we should get started. African American launched the Double V campaign for victory over fascism and against discrimination. Oh, we see something. Oh, that's in the Pacific. Nothing in the uh, Atlantic. It's a lot of completely useless stuff here. Another submarine for Japan. any more hoppers. Yeah, that's one there. Okay. Oh, we're moving on uh, Guajo uh, for Japan. The other uh, units are getting back into positions. I um, need to sort out my units here in Britain. keep scouting for the US Navy it should be arriving soon uh, it is clear weather though so we can use some of the bombers I will try and take advantage of that so I think it's time to put the break in here and I will see you next time have a great day bye bye